everybody here? Oh, I remember. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. I like usually. My workshop keeps me plenty warm and cozy, but I think this year, spring can't come soon enough. I just, well, okay, actually, with the events, I'm all for better, I guess. Yeah. Hey, everybody. Happy Friday. I got confused because I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> you look troubled. Do oh, I? no. I'm, I'm not. Not at all. It's just my face. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have anything? Oh, wait. No, I can't. I can't give that to you, can I? Dang it. And I've got nothing. Ah. Okay. Yeah, all right, let's 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 look. So, my friend Tiger told me this one, she thinks I got a little early. Uh, yeah, so I have to keep that. Okay, two more days, so that'll be this episode. In a million years. Working on that. Okay, all right. All right. Uh, hi, Perry. But yeah, hopefully everybody had a good week. Will you be providing a table of offerings to us at the winter feast? Uh, tone-wise, this might not be the best time to leave public offerings for the Fae. You know, in front of Otto. <sighs> Why don't I just give you the offerings? I, c I could buy one. And <laughs> then I could go give it to Damien, but that's... Too much money. <laughs> okay. I don't think I need anything from you. And it's all open. Okay. I don't think I have anything to sell either. Hello, Ariel. Please turn the season soon, Wildling. This winter has been harsher than a tiger's teeth. I don't know how much longer all the creatures can handle it. Wildling? Oh, I guess my la last name is Wild, so I guess he calls me a wildling. I don't remember that, but okay. Alright, um... <laughs> I have been thrown off my game. <laughs> did I... Yeah, I guess I did. Okay, um... I regret finishing everything <laughs> for myself to make it easier. Oh no. Okay. Um. Yes. Yeah, so let's do that. And then what was it? It was the reverse time. I have an amethyst. So we can do that. And then it was the night time. It is night time stuff, right? Night. Summon night spell. Three of them? Oh my god. Just, just because, yeah. Okay, um. Well. Oh, we're going back into the mine. Alright, uh, so Shelby needs that one. I want to go look on the... Actually, hang on. I know I'm all over the place right now. I'm a little... A little tired today. Pardon me. Um... I do have some wool to turn into cloth. I think I need to get chicken feed, too. There you go. Oh, Tara? You're sweet. Why can't I talk to her? Did I already do that? Okay. Mm 
All right. Let's just, um... Let's go fishing. Let's go get some more salmon. <sighs> Gathering more flowers for his dad. Which is probably the sweetest thing I've seen him do. Oh, I'm chopping down a tree by accident. Oh well. Yes. The way she says yes. <laughs> hmm. I found something. <gasps> a recipe. A recipe. Bav. No, Pav Baji. That looks good. What is that? Is that radish? What is that? No. Red cabbage. Not radish. Red cabbage. That's gotta be red cabbage, right? I don't think I know of another... Anything that would be... I don't know. It looks pretty, though. Ooh. Ooh. Cool. Ooh. I'll just keep saying ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Alrighty, let's go with the cricket on that big boy. Give me a salmon if you don't mind. Oh. No. <gasps> Got one. Oh. Okay. Rainbow trout. Okay. That's not what I wanted, but all right. Thanks all to. Why was I about to say Wesley? Bruno. Ask me if we can make soup together for the winter feast. It's a lovely idea, but mm. I'm only an average cook. I've always been too busy with my studies to develop many kitchen skills. Still, my Aji left me a recipe book, <sighs> just like the one your Aji left you. Maybe we can pull together a mulligatawny soup. Aji. So I'm assuming grandmother. Maybe grandparent? Yeah, I'll just use a cricket to pull that one up. And then maybe it'll bring me another big one. <sighs> I'm just trying to get some salmon for Wesley. Oh, yeah. Well then, um, let's go to the mine. I think I need to go to the gloaming, but we'll do that tomorrow. It's okay if those plants wait. I need gold. I need gold and I need goodies. And sand, that's right, ooh. Oh, man. So this week's been kind of crazy. Um, I had a job interview. And doing, pending the back background check and everything else, I will hopefully be gainfully employed uh, this next week. So that will be awesome. Um... Yeah. It was very nerve wracking, let me tell you. But I'm excited because that means I can beef up my bank account a little bit. Excellent, an emerald. And I have been steadily working on the Hufflepuff scarf. I've almost got it done, but I'm also a bit behind. <sighs> It's okay. And then my friend ended up going to the ER suddenly, so I dropped everything to make her soup. Which is why I made chicken noodle soup. And why I'm currently very, 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 very full. Uh. But I have not injured myself this week. So, you know, 
We're getting somewhere. <laughs> the toenail has not fallen off yet. So. Ah, and I figured out a... Well, fairly decent breakthrough on one of the overall backstory plots for Lost in Time. Not backstory plot, but things that are going on in the background, but, um... Specifically a family feud that has been bothering me for a while. I am not going to talk so much. Uh-oh. I'll be there in a minute! And I will be right back. My parents just got home. So let me get to bed real quick. I had a heart attack just now thinking I was not recording. Am I, I will ready? be there in a minute, mama. Do, 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 do. Be right back. Wait, what? You son of a bitch. What are you doing? What are you doing? No, get away from there. Get away from there. No! <laughs> What? Why do you want the gloaming so bad? Oh no. No, 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 no. <gasps> Snow! Yay! Okay, I will be right back. Now! That Mom, give me a moment, please. Okay, I am back. Sorry about that. Good news is I'm feeling a little bit better. Had to go chat with my family for a little bit. I... Ooh, grand question. I think we'll do another rum. Mm -mm -mm. So that was something else. Excuse me. Raven. What the heck, man? Right, uh, who are we working on? Is it Lena? Are we working on Lena? Hang on. Because I know what one of the things Lena likes. I've passed her, where is she? Okay, um, so... Huh... All right, what I'm going to do is, because I know what one of the things Lena likes, I don't want to waste this on a one, you know, a 50-50 shot. So we're going to start working on somebody else. Hmm. I kind of want to do Vanessa. So let's do Vanessa. Oh, I think I see something. Mm -hmm. Fruit salad, spinach smoothie, a quiche. So far, it's there's been something green and everything. Okay. Well, and then we will be done with that. Fairly cool. Oh! Ordered the Winter Wonderland. It's so pretty! I love uh, it. Was it me? I'd better go check and see how everyone is doing. Wait, did I? No, I did. <gasps> what? She's in a panic, everyone. She is still a seaworthy <gasps> vessel. You're as soon as kidding the ice me. melts, we'll have the best engineer in milk water come over on a tugboat and pull her out into the harbor for repairs. That could be a while. If my forecast is correct, we could be socked in for weeks. Socked now, in. let's try to remain positive. Give us right. At the very least, we ought to try and patch the hole in the hull before she takes on too much water. I'll help. That's the spirit. You see, with the right attitude, we'll get through this together. Shut up, Otto. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to, um, uh, check on the town stores. Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. Tara, you wouldn't happen to be growing any tea on your farm, would you? Kai's all out of loose-leaf tea, and I haven't had a good chai in ages. 
I'm not, gotcha. but I could. That would be amazing. Well, yes, we are. I said he still has some tea seeds. Oh, but for a proper chai, you'll need a few other things too. Here's my favorite way to make it. Oh, thank you for giving me the recipe. Awesome. Have any luck growing the tea? Yes, it's ready. Fantastic. Would you mind coming with me then? I promised Cameron I would bring a pot of tea oh, for our meeting. No, meeting? No. I didn't know you joined the league. Oh, I didn't. It's no. well just no. come. You'll see. No. Why? I don't want to be here. I want to give Tara, the twins Molotov. Nice that you're joining no! Us she brewed a pot of chai. Uh, what type of meeting is this? It's a weekly sobriety meeting we hold here at the Consciousness Center. It's what? It's open to the community, but so far it's just been Giva and me. Oh, come on, Tara, sit down. We won't bite. Giva, last week we were discussing how winter can make it more difficult to stay in recovery. All those long hours indoors. Yes. Being outdoors working during the day helps, but nights are hard. I've wanted to go into Damon's bar more times than I can count, just for some extra company. But I've held fast. I'm proud of myself. You should be. Every day without a drink is a victory. Oh, uh, we're not open for regular service just now, Bruno. Uh, huh? <clears throat> excuse me. I uh, thought I read on the notice board there was a meeting today. Yes, absolutely. Welcome. The look on my face. I have shock and my jaw has dropped. Okay. All right. That's okay. <laughs> you know, what? actually, I wonder if Bruno says anything different because of that. I expect the lakes will be frozen over soon. Always did love a day of ice fishing. Just gotta find my old auger. It's around somewhere. I love his little smile. It's great. Okay, so he didn't have anything different to say. Oh! Oh, that's nice. So everyone's talking about the Winter Feast, and everyone says your salmon recipe was always the best thing at the Winter Feast. <laughs> I will try to do you proud, Grandma. Mm, sweetie, you'll do fine. Okay, uh, we have got to find people. So today's episode might be a little bit on the shorter side, just because I do have some other stuff I need to get done tonight. So, yeah. Yeah, thanks, Tara. Well, at least I don't have to worry about running out of ice at the bar. <laughs> like you did in the summer, yeah. Um, let's chat with Sophia. Tara, are you eating enough? Uh, come by whenever you need a hot meal. Aw, thank you. She's got chicken soup. Right, I'm gonna buy one, and I'm also gonna buy a quiche. Shh. 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 We don't tell her I just bought it from her. <laughs> Thank you, Tiger. <laughs> Sweet. <coughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm going to hell for that one. <laughs> Great. Now we're completely trapped on an island. With a bunch of people who actually thought my mom might be a witch. Awesome. Your hair physics are a little funny right there, sweetie. And oh, sweetie, I, I get it. <sighs> and I have nothing you like right now, son of a bitch. Fine. Let's go chat with Kai. I gotta go to the cabin tonight. <sighs> I hope the ferry isn't busted for long. I can paddle pretty far, but like, not all the way across the Fairhaven Sound. Let's not do that, Kai. I'm gonna buy another one of those. And 
and we will give him one of those. <clears throat> yeah, this looks great. It's like I always say, coconuts are the best fruit around. It's because <laughs> they're so big. <laughs> okay. She's closed. They're closed. <sighs> okay. Zephyr and Shelby, which I don't know where Shelby is. I can do that. I took that because I knew that it was something for Sophia. And if I can do anything for Sophia right now, I want to. This landscape is stunning with snow. Oh my gosh. I think this is my favorite season just for how pretty it is. I mean, look at this. Oh. Do my eyes deceive me? What a delightful <laughs> surprise! <clears throat> huh. Kara, there's something I've been meaning to say to you. Okay. Not me being scared for this. I'm so very sorry about your gran. I knew her death was coming, but it still hurt. Hazel and Marcus were the only people I could talk to about where I came from. Sometimes I wish so hard they were still here that I forget they're even gone. You can talk to me. I know I haven't been here as long, <clears throat> but I'll always listen. I think, I think I will tell you just a bit. I was born in Hungary. Ooh, I know, I don't sound like it. <laughs> Spent most of my time on these shores after my parents passed i'm sorry to hear about your parents they knew it was coming they were uh i am romani no one read cards better than my ma but that's a story for another time huh. i think my uh, sharing gears are rusty <laughs> can can that happen No. I'm sorry, I'm sitting there like almost crying that oh you can't lose it. You have to practice, yes, if you're not careful. Mm, I don't know what's the right answer. I mean there's not necessarily a right option, but right or wrong option for this, I think, but I'm I'm gonna go with this one. They might feel rusty. And you can't lose the ability to share parts of yourself. <laughs> That's a relief. Thank you, Tara. You got all the best parts of your grand. I have a lot to learn about witchcraft, but not to toot my own horn. I know how to be a good friend. That you do. Mm. That you do. <gasps> Mike just oh. Oh. oh sorry Yay Oh do I have anything yes I do Oh Is that heavenly aroma fish too? Why, thank you! I'm very happy right now. <laughs> I'm gonna sell like 15. Oh! Oh, I love Shelby. I love. Also, you see his, how his feet kick? I love that. I, but I didn't dare interrupt. No, I would not dare. Oh, hey, Lena. I've got enough goods in my storeroom to last for a couple of weeks. But after oh, that, shit. I can't restock if the ferry isn't running. I thought that was the ferry, but I wasn't 100% sure. I have nothing you like. Bummer. Okay. 
show the game's telling me to get a freaking move on. Meanwhile, I'm more than happy to live in frozen ice land forever, so... <laughs> I mean, I feel like I haven't been slow. Uh, oh. Have I seen you here before? I wonder how my mom and dad are faring on the other side of the Fairhaven Bay. Maybe the storm wasn't so bad over there. I suppose it will be some time before I can visit them again. Oh. Oh my, Quiche is so rich, but if you insist, who am I to say no? I do love it. <laughs> Two cutscenes. Vanessa? Is that you? Oh, hello, Tara. I was just admiring the water. It looks shallow, but it's surprisingly deep here. It makes for a lovely swimming hole. Does, does Otto know that you go swimming in the lake that's, uh... Inside the woods, he absolutely detests. I haven't swum here in years. But when I was a little girl, my family came here on vacation every summer. Those weeks were always the best part of the year. They were how I knew Fairhaven was special to me. <laughs> you visited as well when you were a child. Did you also have that sense? Yes. Whenever my dad brought me to visit my grandmother, I didn't want to go back. Neither did I. <laughs> I wonder what our lives would have been like if we'd grown up here. In any case, I love Fairhaven, even the parts of it my husband doesn't care for. Sometimes it's hard for me to express that love, but I do feel it. That's really sweet, Vanessa. Well, I mean it. Oh, and Tara, don't tell everyone about my spot. I like having space to just be. <laughs> That was sweet. But this is not bad. She's complicated, but she's not bad. Otto just deserves to be in a trash can. <laughs> Sorry, did I say that out loud? <laughs> Alright, let's go find Sophia. Probably find Zephyr? I don't know. I'm trying to decide, go back and then come back, or what? Oh, I know just how I'll use this. It's perfect. You're welcome, sweetie. Huh. Okay. Wasn't there somebody else who needed paper? Uh... Hmm. Yeah. That, I suppose. Oh, was Tara talking about the summon storm spell that we had to do? I'll get more. <laughs> oh. I forgot to check the stuff today. Oh, that's because the fairy. <laughs> I was about to say, wait a minute. This doesn't look right. Why doesn't it look right? Hey, buddy boy. Uh. Hey, planty. Water some plants for me today? Yep, go for it. Get them all watered. Get to it! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get more that going soon. I am gonna grab some of these, plant some of those. It'll be okay. Alrighty, that should be enough for another candle. Alright, so now I want to make an apple cider. Cloth. So. Let's see here. What about dyes? Yellow cloth. So. Oh, wait. 
No, I just need regular cloth. Whoops. We'll do the some black silk, I think. I need two more of those. It's probably going to take a few days. Yeah. Pet the kitty. Oh. Alright, let's go find Zephyr and Wesley, I think. Yeah, let's go to Zephyr real quick. We'll pick up some of that on the way out. Whoa, you've got some steam in your boiler today, Tara. This is great. I do love Zephyr. I wish I could figure out what happened to the fairy, but it only feels safe to look around there when the humans are asleep. And given there's a neighborhood to watch, they're never asleep. Can't wait to get those gem finders oh, up right. and running. Just need to... It's not just silver you need, unfortunately. I'm supposed to live in milk water, but now that the ferry's broken down, you can I just have to tell everyone I'm staying with Damon, even though I'd never really stay there. It's the definition of bachelor pad. <laughs> you could also just stay in Ravenwood, but I get it. The bachelor pad. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to drink some of this while reading the latest detective novels that came in. I love him so much. Alright, where are we at hearts wise with him? Ugh, it's gonna take a million years. Okay, so. So we got Vanessa Thomas Violet. We're working on Sophia. Shelby is done. Parker is done. Otto is done. Sebastian. Perry, we're working on Lena, but Natalia and Marty are done. Still working on Kai. Kim is up there. Juliet, we're still working on. Francis, we are close. I'm surprised, because I feel like I don't really talk to him as much, but I have been making more of an effort. Give us fairly close. Of course, Grandma was there. Finn, we're working on. Damon, I need to talk to you more. Cameron, I need to talk to you more. <laughs> Angus, and then of course, Ariel, and we have Bruno already, so I'm doing a lot better than I was thinking I was, actually. Which is exciting. <sighs> okay, someone made all my forgot forget-me-nots into siren feed. Sirens can feed themselves, you know. I need to replenish my supply. Um, is that a dig at Ariel? Just one night this week, I want to make it home in time to tuck in the kids, but I don't have any freeze time and can't. I will happily help, Lena. Okay. Wesley says that most of the humans are worried about repairing the ferry. But why do you need the ferry? It churns up the water near the shore, and the people who ride it throw trash in the water. Hmm. Best to leave it broken. That is a very short-sighted thing to say. I am told the ferry no longer works. <laughs> Why is this a problem? Can you not simply swim to the mainland? That's a long swim in very, very cold water. Ah, right. Perhaps try evolving wings. <sighs> that is an asinine thing to say. There are times when I don't like talking to the people on this half of the island, but I love talking to the people on that half of the island. <sighs> Just, why? 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 I thought there would be something. Zephyr finished the improvements on my wand. High Priestess. 
I'm glad to hear it. We will need you to be at your full power to face what is to come. Never seen a winter like this on the island before. Hmm, neither have I. I worry that we are too few in number to turn it on our own. We've lost so many in recent years. Violet's mother, then Giacomo Moretti, and now Hazel. There's help out there, if we are ready to seek it. I think I know your meaning, but we've never had to call a witch to the circle before her powers came in. Wait, we can call a new witch to join us? Wait, like, Juliet? on the phone? No, with an incantation. I wasn't paying attention. Perhaps Wesley will have the one we need among his scrolls. Well, there's only two candidates, and that's Wesley or Sebastian. Wait, Wesley? What? No, Juliet. Okay. It, it would have to be Juliet. Because Sebastian's almost 18. Oh, but if Juliet does get called... Again, I was not paying attention, sorry. Um, I was looking at something on my phone. For a second. Should have been paying attention. Just was not. Uh, if... Especially with how angry Juliet is right now. I'm not sure that's the smartest option. Hmm. Alright, I... Let's go into the mine for a bit. That could be a problem. But then you gotta wonder, well, it wouldn't be the twins. It wouldn't be Emmy or Fen, but Emmy or Fen could very well become a witch later. Of course, this raven person. Again, why do they want to get in the gloaming so bad? nerve-wracking, really. I do wonder, though, why is it that... I mean, clearly it's an attack. Clearly someone's doing it. Why are we not making a harder effort to find them? Can we not? Like, can't we scry or take, like, bits of the, the gate? And scry? Is that not something we can do? Should I? Yes. Mm. Do not ask me that question, Tara. Oh, man. Yeah, that fairy is a problem, though. Especially if it's food. I mean, I can provide some stuff. The feast is today. Head to town square. Someone has to do a task complete. Okay. Oh, I'm nervous about this feast. Very nervous about it. Oh, I don't have any more fine sand. Alright. Um, let's do Vanessa. Just to finish it off. Hmm. Oh, I think I see something. Fennel salad, of course. And I don't have anything. Um... Trying to decide who to do next. Um, well, 
black, so that's just easy. I don't have any more sand. Nope. Working on that still. Um, I got some olives. Is anything ready here that looks like they're ready? Ooh, and some spinach. So we've got three. Do this two sweet potatoes. I'll do the onion. Hi. I have not been petting my pets today. Whoopsies. Haven't done it at all this episode. Oops. Well, I guess it's a good time to see if the heart went down on the chickens. I gotta get them food. Ooh, I gotta get them food. They're they're hungry today. It looks like the hearts did not go down. Okay, I am going to swing by Marty's if he's supposedly open. I wish we could make our own chicken feed. I wish we could. <sighs> oh, whoop. Hang on. Come here. Come here, feedy. Okay, so we got two more days of chicken feed. I also need to go into the kitchen and see what I can make, because I think I can make tiramisu. Hey, kitty kitty. Okay. I can make a fennel salad, but I'm not going to. Trying to look around and see what all I can do that I know is someone's favorite. Again, I wish she sold carrots. That would be so much easier. Okay. I'll make two more of those for Kai. I think I'll hold off because I don't know exactly if I want to do that with the rum or not. Oh, we have stuff for Juliet. No strawberries. Okay. Well. Alright, so. Marty is here. So he is open, supposedly, but it is today is the winter feast, and today is also the last day I'm going to play, so the episode will be wrapping up after this. Thank God. Uh, the gentleman farmer quarterly says livestock need feed when it's cold to keep their body temperatures up. Uh, I can't deal with another cow getting sick. I was about to make a disparaging remark, but then I realized what he was talking about. Yeah. Alright. Oh, I'd better get to the town square for the winter feast. Oh, okay, so it literally forces me here. That's fine. Okay. Nothing keeps you warmer inside than smoke trout. <laughs> I love sitting inside the fish smokehouse as a boy. Real cozy. I'll take your word for it. Hmm. 
<laughs> I love Bruno. A few weeks ago, I showed Angus how to make coquito, and he liked it so much that I made another batch for the winter feast. What's coquito? I was oh, about to ask. Mija. It's a Puerto Rican holiday tradition, sort of like eggnog, but with coconut milk. Didn't <sighs> realize you were Puerto Rican. Oh my god, that sounds amazing, though. Like, I, I, I want that. Okay, you've got a little thing over your head, so no. Uh, there's so much snow coming down. I, wait. Was it even snowing? Shelby, are you okay? This winter feast is such a pleasant idea. I came around Cameron's consciousness center and showed him how to make mulligatawny soup. It's not as good as what you get in Mumbai, but we did all right. Nice. Okay. Hey, Thomas. I made steamed cabbage, but no one is eating it. Huh. Maybe you could add some seasoning next time. What's wrong with plain cabbage? <laughs> doesn't have a good flavor. <laughs> Alright. I love southern cabbage. Where you, you mix it with some um, bacon. Bacon grease. You add in a bunch of seasonings. And uh, you just let those flavors mix together. And it's delicious. But like steamed cabbage with no seasonings. Bleh, no thank you. It's a relief that Kim handled the roast this year. They never undercooked the meat. A few years ago, Kai said he'd oh do the no. roast, but he took it out too early. Ugh. Imagine trying to take care of an entire town with food poisoning. <gasps> oh. Yara, I'm trying to eat. Oh. Cabbage soup. I love shiitake. Nothing like an umami burst to keep the cold away. A what? And a what? Man, this looks yummy though. Like everything looks good. Oh, winter makes me homesick for milk water. Except for the winter feast. We don't have anything like this in milk water. Or maybe there was and I never noticed. My family didn't go to many uh, potlucks. Yeah. How you doing, sweetie? Everyone says Emmy and Finn are annoying, but I think they're fun. Right? And during feast, I can have a snowball fight with them. That way, no one's saying, why is that grown woman throwing snow around like a kid? Ah, the classic, I did it for the children excuse. <laughs> they are fun. I love them. You could have brought cookies like us, but you brought fish? You. <laughs> oh god, why are you here? I know why, I just don't like you. I see you brought fish. That's very nice. I was asked to, dumbass. Oh, don't forget to try my sweet potato casserole. Sweet potatoes are like if Yummy. regular potatoes went out and had a bunch of life experiences. They're just way more interesting. <laughs> Don't tell my Polish ancestors I said that. <laughs> <laughs> it would be weird yeah. if I could. <laughs> okay, Tara. All right, I just realized that this is likely actually, yeah. Oh my stars above. <laughs> Oops, I'm channeling my mama, but I couldn't help it. This blew me away. Hmm. I like working with my hands. But I've never been a good cook, so I stick to making the booths for Winter Feast. And we get sugar cookies for Emmy and Finn to decorate. That's the Doll Johnson contribution. Aww, that's great. <sighs> this is right. Hey, Tara, I'm writing a letter to my mom, but I keep messing up and now I'm out of paper. Have any? I think I can get you some. Oh! Damon has asked you to bring him some paper so he can write to his mother in South Africa. Oh, I didn't realize it was in South Africa. Oh, okay. I think Here's I your paper, some. Damon. So, I think I have what extra. are you writing your mom about? Thanks. Well, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I shit. might be telling her about a new friend who's becoming kind of special to me. 
You better only be writing nice things, Damon. <laughs> nope. I'm telling her about what a troublemaker you are. <laughs> Thanks again for the paper. I hope you get to meet my ma someday. She's a really cool lady. No, thank you. Oh, joy. I'm excited. I'm just nervous. Ever since my parents went back to Johannesburg, they mail me Amarula to bring to the winter feast. Hot chocolate with whiskey? Boring. Hot chocolate with Amarula? Mm. Um, what's Amarula? Thank you for the hot chocolate. <gasps> Hubby! Soon. I'm trying Eventually. not to look overwhelmed. But I haven't been to a feast this pleasant in years. Are you okay? Yes. Just homesick. And grateful to Kim for inviting me. I want to hug him. Do I have anything? Of course not. Why would I? Apparently. Sorry, sweetie. I know I've already talked to you. Have you tried my caramel milk? It's like a caramel latte, but there's no coffee. Sophia makes the only decent espresso on the island, so... Ew. Caramel milk does not sound good. <sighs> Here, have your paper. Hey, I was hoping someone might help me with this. Thanks a lot. I've gotten much better at cooking. Giva showed me how to make mulligatawny soup. Smell this. Isn't it delicious? Sure. Only because I don't know what mulligatawny soup is. Mm -hmm. Oh, I tried your salmon. It's delicious. Just like Hazel used to make. Aw, I'm glad somebody complimented it. Oh, you're so thoughtful, Tara. I'm glad you're around. <laughs> Love you too, Lena. Violet's been dealing with a lot lately, so I told her I'd handle the winter feast for us. Mm -hmm. I made boxed mac, which is the best food I know. But she's acting <laughs> mad at me. <laughs> okay. I told Sebastian he could handle our winter feast food, and he made instant mac and cheese. Sophia should be here. But also, it's good she's not. She'd never let me forget this. Yeah. Yeah, I get that. Mm -hmm. I get that. Actually, do I have... <sighs> I do. Have it. Happy winter feast. <laughs> I'm not going to say no to a surprise snack. We're getting up there with him, I think. Hopefully. Last year... Juliet helped us make snowballs so we could have a snowball fight with Natalia and Angus. I wish she was here. Yeah, me too, bud. Me too. And actually, I just remembered. Happy winter Yum. feast. Sometimes my mom says I'm a pastatarian, but can you blame me? Bolognese is delicious. It is. Do I have anything else on me that anyone would appreciate that I know of that also I do not have full hearts with at this time? That that could be for Kai. And I think that's it. So where's Kai? I haven't talked to him yet. Ah, cooking isn't my thing. You have to be so careful, you know? I'm too, like, uh, chill for that. <laughs> One year before Kim moved here, I said I'd make Kalua pork for the winter feast roast. It smelled ono, but turns out I undercooked it. Yeah, I heard about that. Mm -hmm. Here you go, Mm-hmm. Yeah, this looks great. It's like I always say. Coconuts are the best fruit around. It's because they're so big. Mm -hmm. Okay. What am I supposed to do? I mean, I did. I don't think I can do anything else. I can tell Juliet and Sophia aren't here, though.
So it's 4.30 p.m. Actually, I was about to say, where's Bruno? But then I realized... Yeah, this is what's a little awkward. It's just everybody's just standing awkwardly after you talk to them. I guess I'm just gonna go? Like, I don't know what else to do. Go back down and <laughs> get this to Natalia, I guess? <laughs> uh, that's fine. Oh, this is great. You're a lifesaver. Thanks for the money. Hey, we're at 4,200 now. Okay, I think we're gonna go to the woods. Take a look-see around. Yeah. Am I sure I'm done with the feast? Yeah. I mean, there's, there's nothing else to do. I do wish Juliet and Sophia had been able to be there except people decided to ruin it for them because you know we need 21st century witch hunts and i will never let that go i am salty also what was up with shelby was he drunk like I don't know what was up with him, but I didn't see... What is she doing here? What is Sophia doing in here? Juliet's been freaking ever since the ferry broke down. She keeps saying we should have just moved to Italy after my trial. <laughs> As if you can just move to Italy. <laughs> I've never even been there. And she didn't even seem to enjoy the one trip she took with her dad. Um. I have a horrible thought. What if it's so... F what if Juliet is Raven? Not Ray, uh, Juliet, Sophia. What if, oh my god. No, 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 no. What, what was she doing here? I didn't even realize the townsfolk could see that. Ga I mean, the gate's broken now, but. What, huh? What? Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I don't like it at all. Um, right. I gotta go chat with Wesley, so... Do I have to do that when he's open, I wonder? Oh, crap, Ola. Also, how it... So... No, it looks like it's still in place for what? But Juliet, what are you doing here? Sometimes my hands feel like they're sparking with static electricity. Oh, I guess it's just because everyone's got their heat on blast since it's so cold out. Ah, fudge! Is Juliet? Why are they both here? What? What? How is this possible? Like, what's happening? Oh my gosh. All right, well, we're here, so let's see if... Oh my god. Okay. How do you know that another witch is going to just... Join us. The Wellspring has a way of calling witches from all over the world. Ah. Sometimes people who move here don't even realize that they're witches, like you. Okay. We any closer to sorting out who shattered our gate into pieces, High Priestess? No, That's what I was asking. But whoever did it left the cauldron and altar unbothered. 
The glamour must still be holding. But who outside of the coven or Ravenwood Hollow would have the power to break the gate in the first place? Um, I hate to bring this up, but it's not just magical intruders we need to worry about. Giva has a new drone that she's been testing in order to release something called drop sons into the atmosphere. That must be the secret new project she was talking about. The good news is she's not very good at piloting it yet. I only know she has it because she crashed it by my house. That's oh. bad news, actually. If she were to crash it by our circle, she would come in after it. We can't risk it. Novice, you must find a way to sabotage this new oh, drone shit. so that it won't work. Can't we place a magical barrier to keep the drone out? Magical barriers would not work against a mechanical device of human shit. invention. We simply can't allow it to come near. You Great. will need Zephyr's assistance. I'm sure she can fashion something that will prevent the drone from working. Shit. It's sabotage! Okay. Shit. Why were Sophia and Juliet here? I've never seen anyone outside of Kevin members in that club. I'm not doing nothing. What in the hell? I don't understand. So what? Is it at this point in the story? Just people start wandering in there and just explore? Like, what's up with that? Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I can work on that. Alright. Hi, Zephyr. I know why you're here. The High Priestess told me you have a nosy mortal problem. A little bit. I can make a scrambling device so that any data the drone picks up will be useless. Just need you to get me some copper so I can make some wire to redirect the transmitter. And some gold for the connector pins. Lots of metal. Got it. Ah, uh, I was about to say. I was about to say, I got copper and spades, but... Someday, I'll get my weather machine working. Then the coven won't be all on your own for sorting out the seasons. That is very sweet. I love Zephyr. I think I'm gonna work on her things next. Dang it, I was hoping I could. But no, I have to. So I have to be... He has to be open. So let's see here... Tuesday, Wednesday, it closed. A freaking course. All right, well. They, their hours are inconvenient. Then again, perhaps you humans should repair the ferry. Zephyr won't stop talking about her plans to fix it. She is going to explode my brain. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I have nothing to say for that. Mm, I don't envy Lena. She has had to carry more burdens than many of her ancestors who were high priests and priestesses. Wow. And how many of those have you known? Each doll who lies sleeping in the Fairhaven Cemetery, I have known. <sighs> wow. That really hurts my brain to think about. Yeah, considering Lena's been on this island for a very long time, and that really means that one of her children is going to eventually get it. Lovely. Alright, um... I really do need gold. Yeah, you know what? Yeah. We'll try to get more salmon next time, but I need gold. And, um, you know, I've got... Let's see here, actually. How much do we have gold-wise? So we've got 14. And it takes, what, two or three? And I'm going to have to take five of them, so that's nine. I'll either have just enough or not quite enough, so yeah, but either way I do need some sand, so also need some iron, cause all of mine got taken by Natalia earlier in exchange for money. 
Which is never a bad thing, per se, but I do gotta replenish it. Okay, so that's enough for one more. But I need to find sand for potions, too, so I need to go get more. There was one of those. Okay, I'm gonna quickly run through, look for sand deposits, grab all of them, and then whatever we have remaining. Time-wise, I will grab ore. Like now. There's one over there. Ah, so actually, you know what? This isn't bad time-wise because... Okay, yeah, but that's it. Um, it's still an hour, so we're, we're fine. We had a lot of cutscenes, and we had the festival and stuff. The festival was chill. I was not expecting it to be. I'm gonna grab that. Grab that one. Alright. Well, we only got, what, one gold? That wasn't good, but that's... It's whatever, right? Okay. So we're gonna have to Am go see Natalia bed? next time. But, yeah, we should have, hopefully, enough to get things going. Alrighty. Looks like we got some fruit trees to harvest next time on Monday. And I will probably try to make it a bit of a longer episode, just to make up for today. Again, sorry about that, but truth be told, I want to do a mini stream. And I've got some people asking. And, uh, yeah. Just depending on how the fall goes, which is something I haven't really talked about um, in too much detail, mainly because I'm still waiting to see. But essentially there is the possibility that some or most or all of my gaming content will be put on hold for a bit. Um, just depending on things. So there's, you know, a few games that I've been streaming and stuff that, and recording, that I just want to get done. So, yeah. Um, but again, I'm still waiting and I'll make an actual up update video when that happens. When I kind of figure out what the hell is going to happen. So yeah. Anyway guys, happy Friday. Um, let me know what you thought about today's episode. Um... Tiger, I need you to tell me why Juliet and Sophia were there. Um, did, was that a glitch? Did, I, did, did, did have you seen that? Does that actually, like, what, what, what's going on? And Shelby made me want to cry. Oh, and that Raven person is doing some not good stuff. It is crazy. Man, things are going nuts. And the, the Vanessa was also very sweet. And the fairy. Oh dear. Ariel just... Oh, you don't need the fairy. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Perry, why don't you swim? <sighs> anyway. Guys, have a great one. I will possibly see you next time. If anyone's interested in more. Uh, on Monday, and uh, yeah, we'll keep on trucking, so yeah.